Hi everyone. Today I'm going to be showing you how to add an image to your blog post. And this really adds a nice professional look. Um, and you'll have to do this for your um, photograph reflection piece that we worked on in class on Thursday and shared on Friday. And uh, right now I just have a, a essay that I wrote last year in here. And what I would like to do is show you how to add a photo. So this is in my add a blog post section. So you guys by, no, by now know how to get here. And you'll notice this button right here allows you to add an image. So let's say at the end of this paragraph right here, I want to add an image. So I hit image. And then I choose a file. And let's say I want to go with this file picture of my dad and I reading the one I showed you on Thursday. This layout section allows you to add where the photo is going to show up. So let's say I want it to come to the right. I hit right, I hit OK, and voila, there it is. And you can notice the text over here wraps around it, which is a pretty cool feature. Now, what I also wanted to show you is that you can edit the image. So let's say I don't really like that it's in the middle, I want it to be, or I don't like that it's in the right, I want it to be on the left. Hit left, okay, it's done. You can also use this to shrink the sizes. So I can make it come in like that, I can make it a little bigger like that, um, and you can make that kind of cool effect of, almost looks like it's in an article, right? I'll add another one right here just to show you. Let's say for this one I decide to use the lovely picture of our team from last year. I hit open, and now it's giving me some options. Do I want the full size? Do I want the smaller size? Um, I want this one in the center. So I hit center, okay, and there it is. Now I like that it's in the center, but it might be just a little too big. So I pull in like that. and I'm done. As a reminder, the easiest place and the easiest way to find this or to find a photo is I would just suggest that you have it already on your desktop and then when you're adding a file, it's, it's identical to adding a file to Facebook or Tumblr or any of those social media sites. Um, it's really cool. It adds a nice layer onto your work and don't forget that in addition to posting your final draft of your photograph reflection, you also have to include a creative title and embed the photo to show that you have that skill. Um, so when you're done, say you want to see how it looks like, you hit preview. And this preview will show you exactly what your blog will look like. And if you're happy with it, you would hit click out of this open window. It brings you back and you'll be ready to publish. I hope you find this helpful, and I look forward to seeing the final drafts of your blogs, which are due on Tuesday. Thank you.